Hi, I'm Andy. Hi, I'm Dora. We work for Take Your Place, a government funded project which aims to support young people to make informed decisions about their future, raise aspirations and widen participation to higher education. This presentation will cover your options if your first choice progression plans don't work out. Maybe you didn't get the grades you wanted, or perhaps you're considering alternatives. Don't worry, this presentation is here to help you think of alternatives and to find ways into uni if you still want to go. So you wanted to go to university, but you haven't been offered a place yet. Don't panic, there's still time. Many universities will still offer places for courses starting this September. UCAS Extra is open from the 25th of February to the 4th of July. Also, you can use the UCAS search tool to look for another course either at the uni that you have applied for or a different one. Unis may then get back to you to offer you a place which you can either accept or decline. If you would like any more information on this, we have some really useful fact sheets available on the Take Your Place website under resources. This will cover the subject in a lot more detail. Just go to takeyourplace.ac.uk slash resources. There are more alternatives if you did not get any offers for universities or if you did not get the right grades. One of these is you could appeal your grade, or you could resit your exams, or you can go through clearing. So what is clearing? Clearing is when universities offer out their remaining places to students, often with revised entry requirements. You will have to contact the university directly, over the phone, or via chat, and apply for a place. You may have a short interview, or the university could offer you a place there and then, if you meet their entry requirements. Places fill up quickly, so you want to be in contact with them as soon as you can, after you receive your results. But do not rush into a decision. Take some time to think about it and to discuss this with others, such as your friends and family. If you decide you no longer want to go to university, or perhaps you weren't interested in going in the first place, then you still have lots of options. You can defer entry or withdraw your application completely. Deferring your application means that you can ask your chosen university to hold your place for one year if your application has been successful. They don't have to do this, but many are happy to do so. It's a good option as this can allow you to have a gap year in which you can travel, volunteer or gain employment. When the time comes, you can choose to go to your university or you may realise that this isn't the right option for you. You may want to withdraw your application and look into alternative routes. If you feel that university is not for you, then there are alternatives. We have some useful fact sheets and resources with further information on these on the Take Your Place website. Some alternatives are, look for a job. We have some information about searching for jobs and writing a CV. Have a look at these if you feel this is the best option for you. An apprenticeship. Again, we have lots of useful resources on these. Please have a look at the uh, information on our website, including information on higher and degree level apprenticeships. Volunteer. This not only gives you some great experience, but will show that you are public spirited and looks great on a CV or university application. Travel. Many young people use the opportunity to travel, experience new places and cultures. Or you can choose to do a mixture of all of these options. Perhaps you would like to work part-time or gain an income, but also want to volunteer on the side. Experiencing setbacks can be difficult. We all have to experience them, but unfortunately, they are a part of life. They are something that we can all learn and grow from. Here are some of our top tips on how to deal with them. Focus on things that you can change. For example, if you are not happy with your grades, you can look into appealing, doing resets or even look into alternative provision which will enable you to get where you want to be. Don't beat yourself up. This is a challenging time for everyone. Like we covered earlier, setbacks are a part of life and something that we all have to go through in order to grow and develop. Remember that there are always alternative routes to success. If you have your heart set on a particular career path, remember there are always different ways into that career. There are not necessarily the traditional routes. It may be a good idea to look into degree apprenticeships. Also, many people take a break from education for several years and come back later in life, perhaps doing an access course which are open to students 19 and over. Take time to reflect. 
Think about what you really want in life and what is important to you. Ask for help. A problem shared is a problem halved. Remember you have lots of people that you can talk to, such as teachers, parents, carers, friends, careers advisors, higher education champions, wellbeing teams, student services and student support teams in your school or college. Remember there is lots of help available on the Take Your Place website. Thanks for watching. Head to our website for more detailed advice and information about all of this and more. We hope you found this useful.